welcome to this week's Singing Assembly. Hope you've all had a good week and you've been working really hard. I was glad to see so many people watching the Singing Assembly last week and joining in. So that's what it's here for, to have a bit of fun and to also improve our abilities. So, to start with, a new genre, or one that we've learned before, was soul music. And that was a music that started over in America in about the 1960s. And it was music that was made to be danced with, and it was kind of love songs. And things that you might listen out for is a lot of percussion, like a tambourine shaking as it goes. A steady beat, something that you can dance along to and walk along to. And some of the famous musicians. This is one of my most uh, favourite genres. So we've got Stevie Wonder, got Marvin Gaye, got Diana Ross. There are so many different musicians. So if you look up Soul, and particularly the Motown label, you'll be able to hear these famous musicians. It came over to England and fused with kind of the disco scene and made northern soul music and there's even more songs and famous things from that genre. So if you're feeling interested in soul music, listen and look up soul and northern soul. And I'm sure there'll be some things that you like which we can discuss next time I see you. So what I want us to do is to warm up using a soul song. So first thing, are your feet flat on the floor? Yes they are, yes they are. Are you standing nice and straight? Yes I am, yes I am. Put your shoulders up to your ears. And then put them down, and then up to your ears. And down, and roll those shoulders. Roll them forwards. How about we warm up our bodies along to a soul song? Are you ready? Ready. So, first thing first, two shoulders. Up, down. Down, up, down, roll them. That's it, and forwards. Brilliant. Shake those hands or rub those hands together. Get them all charged up. Let's do a crocodile clap all together. Are you ready? Great job. My turn, your turn. My turn. Shake those hands, we're feeling warm. You can walk on the spot in time with the beat if you would like. And now we're gonna warm up our voice. My turn. sound. So do you remember last week we got a magic pencil and wherever you moved your finger you got to trace some sounds. So my turn and you can copy. Your go. My go. Your go. My go. Your go. My go. My go. My go, oh, your go, oh, my go, oh, your go, oh, my go, sss, your go, Last time we had a go at singing up our numbers. So can everyone go for me? My turn, your turn. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. My go. Five, four, three, two, one. Your go. Five, four, three, two, one. So you might go. Do, re, mi, fa, so. Do, re, mi, fa, so. So, fa, mi, re, do. Your go. So, fa, mi, re, do. A, E, I, O, U. A-E-I-O-U 
Do re mi fa so, do re mi fa so. So I've been teaching some of the classes a rhyme that can help us go not just from one, two, three, four, five, but up to eight. And this is about a llama. Can everyone say llama? And the llama's name is Lucy. So can you say Lucy the llama? And Lucy the llama, she swallowed a banana. Can you say Lucy the llama swallowed a banana? Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. Now, she peeled it first, she peeled it first, so it didn't really harm her. So it didn't really harm her. My turn, my turn. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. She peeled it first, so it didn't really harm her. She peeled it first, so it didn't really harm her. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. She peeled it first, so it didn't really harm her. Peeled it first, so it didn't really harm her. So with that, we can add some melody. And we go up the scale. So I'll sing the whole thing. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana, she peeled it first so it didn't really harm her. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana, she peeled it first so it didn't really harm her. Your go! Off we go! Lucy the llama swallowed a banana, she peeled it first so it didn't really harm her. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana, she peeled it first so it didn't really harm her. You notice we went from low to high pitch. So I had to really make sure I was concentrating on my breathing to get up there. Let's do it one more time all together. Loo, that's a notes. Ready? Off we go. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. She peeled it first so it didn't really harm her. Lucy the llama swallowed a banana. She peeled it first so it didn't really harm her. Great job! Give yourselves a pat on the back for that one. We'll come back to that, but that's really good to go up a scale. We're going up in pitch, but we've been practicing our tongue twisters, haven't we? So everyone give your face a massage. Might as well massage behind your ears as well and massage your heads as well. And you go... And we're all ready now, so our tongue twisters. First one was red lorry, yellow lorry, red lolly, yellow lolly, red leather, yellow leather, red lorry, yellow lorry. One, two, off we go. Red lorry, yellow lorry, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather, red lorry, yellow lorry. I got it wrong, but I'm sure you got it right. Then we did unique New York. Are you ready? Off we go. Unique New York, you need New York, you know you need unique New York. Good job, everybody. And then the one I taught you last week was about the Irish wristwatch. Let's see if I can remember it. This is an Irish wristwatch. I wash my Irish wristwatch. You watched me wash my Irish wristwatch. I even washed my Swiss wristwatch. Do you want to try it with me? Ready? Off we go. This is an Irish wrist watch. I washed my Irish wrist watch. You watched me wash my Irish wrist watch. I even washed my Swiss wrist watch. Ah, oh, take a deep breath, go. Ah, oh, that's great, great singing, and you're pronouncing those words. So another tongue twister for you. I may have done this one. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. It's hard. I'll put the words up on the screen. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. Your go. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. And there's a melody to this. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. And we're asking a question saying, if Peter. So it goes, if Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. One, two, off you go. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's the peck of pickled peppers? Where's a peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? That's it. Where's a peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? Where's a peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? So, two lines together. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's a peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? And then we just do it again, but we go up. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's a peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? Do you want to try it? The words are on the screen. It's just trying to get those pa 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 sounds. Can everyone go pa 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 pa? Yoga. Pa 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 pa. My go. Pa 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 pa. Yoga. Pa 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 pa. Great job. So my turn, your turn. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, where's a peck of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? 
Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Where's a pack of pickled peppers? Pizza Piper picked. If Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's a pack of pickled peppers? Pizza Piper picked. Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Where's a pack of pickled peppers? Pizza Piper picked. Let's try it all together. One, two. Off we go. If Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's the pack of pickled peppers Pizza Piper picked? If Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's the pack of pickled peppers Pizza Piper picked? And after what we do, we go, I don't know. Let's do it all again. And every time we get faster. So I don't know. Ready? Let's do it all again. A pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Pepper Piper peppers, pizza pepper pick. If Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's the pack of pickled peppers Pizza Piper picked? I don't know. Let's do it all again. If Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's the pack of pickled peppers Pizza Piper picked? If Pizza Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers, where's the pack of pickled peppers Pizza Piper picked? <gasps> Fantastic job we got there. I'll leave you with that one to practice, and hopefully we'll have that sounding really good with all those pepper 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 sounds. Give yourselves a pat on the back, everybody that's watching. Well done! Let's recap some of our songs from last week. This first one was called Baby One and it involved us going one, two, three, and then touching our heads and our shoulders. So ready? One, two, off we go. Baby one, two, three, heads and shoulders. Baby one, two, three, shoulders, knees and baby one, two, three, heads and shoulders, shoulders, knees and knees and toes and baby one, to, 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 to join in. Baby one, two, three, heads and shoulders, baby one, Two, three, shoulders, knees, and baby one. Two, three, heads and shoulders, shoulders, knees, and knees and toes, and baby one. One more time, off we go. Baby one, two, three, heads and shoulders, baby one. Two, three, shoulders, knees, and baby one. Two, three, heads and shoulders, shoulders, knees, and knees and toes, and baby one. Good job. We also did the Grand Old Duke of York last week. Let's have a go at that. Oh, the Grand Old Duke. And when they were up, they were up with a clap, and when they were down, they were down. Marching on the spot. Oh, the grand, ready? Oh, one, two, three. Oh, the grand old Duke of York. He had 10,000 men. He marched them up to the top of the hill and he marched them down again. And when they were up, they were up. And when they were down, they were down. And when they were only halfway up, they were neither up nor down. Thinking voices. So take the words out. Put them in your head. Ready? One, two, three. Da, 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 da. Great job, everybody. That's fantastic. So what I'm going to do today is teach you a new song. And it's really easy because it's all about tropical fruit. So we've got different fruits but it's hard in the way that we put it together. So you're gonna learn all four parts and then if you've got different people at home or in your classroom, we could split and have four different groups performing at the same time. It's amazing. And the first tropical fruit is a mango. So we go mango, 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 mango. Join in. Mango, 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 mango. Keep going. Mango, 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 mango. Mango, 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 mango. Easy enough. Just say mango, mango, mango. Then it goes up in pitch. The second fruit is a kiwi. Can everyone go kiwi? Kiwi, kiwi, kiwi. And we go like this. Kiwi, 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 that's the hardest one of the lot, I think, because you run out of breath. You have to breathe in between. So it's kiwi, 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 breathe. <gasps> kiwi, 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 and it goes up in pitch. So we've got mango, mango, and we've got kiwi, kiwi, kiwi. The next one is what Lucy the Llama swallowed, and that's a banana. So it goes like this. Banana, banana, banana. With a nice long note on the end. I'll sing, you join in. Off I go. Banana, banana, banana. 
banana, 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 last time, banana, banana, banana. Great job. And the last of our four tropical fruits is a passion fruit. And it goes like this. It comes in early. It goes one, two, three. Pa -pa -pa passion fruit papaya. Pa -pa -pa passion fruit papaya. Now do you know why I was asking you to Peter Piper for the pa -pa 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 -pa? So it's going pa -pa -pa -pash, pa -pa -pa -pash. Try that. Pa -pa -pa -pash, pa -pa -pa -pash. Ready? All together. One, two, three. Off we go, pa 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 passion fruit papaya, 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 pa 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 passion fruit papaya. So, all four of them: mango, mango, kiwi, 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 kiwi. Banana, banana, and pa -pa -pa passion fruit. I am going to show you on a video, it's going to merge into it, four screens with four of me. Bam, 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 bam. And we are going to be singing all four of the songs at the same time. So you can join in, choose which one you want to do, and just sing along with it, see if you can stay in time. And it sounds amazing. Then what you could do, if you've got three other family members or three other people in your class, you could each take one of them, see if you can sing at the same time. And you've got yourself a vocal ensemble or a choir. You don't need any music for it, you just all sing. So have a go at that. I'm gonna put the clip on now. Mango, 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 mango. How good was that? So hopefully you've enjoyed practicing that. We're going to finish with our farewell song, which is Kwahiri. And for Kwahiri, our actions, hands go up, hands go down. Okay, and then tuku na na tena. Ready? One, two, off we go. Kwahiri, Kwahiri. Um pensi Kwahiri, Kwahiri, Kwahiri. Um pensi Kwahiri. Tutu na na tena. Tuki jarewa. Tutu na na tena. Tuki jarewa. This time with a whisper voice. Ready? One, two, three. Kwahiri, Kwahiri, um pensi Kwahiri, 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 um pensi Kwahiri, tutu nana tena, tuki jarewa, tutu nana tena, tuki jarewa. Great job. It has flown by today. What a fantastic singing assembly. Hope you've enjoyed it. I have, and I will see you next time. Remember to keep working hard and stay safe, and I look forward to seeing you whenever that may be. Have fun and goodbye.